It was Monday morning, Depth Corps officer Eugene Sunega reported for duty. Little did he know there would be a random bag and vehicle search of all prison personnel. Sunega was caught promoting prison contraband. The findings have put him in hot water not only with his workplace, but with the feds. DOC spokesperson Jeff Limo. Eugene Sunega, uh, the officer that's uh, mentioned um, on this arrest, um, is under the uh, federal authorities at this point. Earlier today, Sunego was charged in federal court with possession with intent to distribute methamphetamine. According to court documents, a package of contraband was thrown over the fence into the prison compound for an individual identified only as Suspect 1. When the suspect was interviewed by DOC internal affairs officers, the individual implicated Sunega was involved in the criminal drug activity at the facility. Around this time, Limo was already planning and coordinating the unannounced bag check of employees, which included Sunega. Although Sunega was scheduled to report for duty at 6 a.m. on Monday, he called in late and arrived just after 9 a.m. When Sunega's backpack was searched, he denied having any contraband. Rolled up in his jacket, however, was a large package completely sealed in plastic wrap. Upon discovery of the item, he told the searching officer, quote, I'm sorry, sir, end quote, as the contraband inside included cigarettes, cigarette lighters, tobacco, beef jerky, Tabasco sauce, garlic powder, a glass pipe, and a quantity of crystal-like powder, suspected to be a controlled substance, which was later identified as 4.9 grams of crystal meth. According to Limo, Senega is an Officer 1 and has been with the department for the last four years and eight months. As of today, Senega's status with the department is in limbo, as the investigation on DOC's end must be completed within 60 days. There's going to be a lot of people pulled in, uh, both inmates, detainees, and, and, and uh, personnel as well. Uh, and again, um, we would like to protect the integrity of the investigation and not comment further on that. Meanwhile, Limo says he's waiting on Sunega's drug test results and says should other officers be in question, they too could be tested. If it's been reported to our office, um, again, it has to be uh, approved by the Director of Corrections for anybody to be brought down for urinalysis testing. And again, um, the law specifically says that we have to have probable cause. And uh, in this case, we do have probable cause uh, for our Officer Senegal. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Crystal Paco.